All right, how's it going, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen? Your one and only, the lazy ass, Jacko Games, and I've been off doing absolutely nothing with my life for about three months now. And I just came back and realized that YouTube was something I really enjoyed doing, so I'm back at it again. Damn, Daniel. <laughs> Anyways. I got something new. I got something that I thought could be a lot of fun for first to start with. And second, I just, oh, the game is so much fun. You guys are gonna love it, right? Here we go. Let's do this. It's called the Shakes and Fidget. Now, it's like a click and uh, just like wait around base game. Basically, you click, you know, you get a quest, you complete the quest. You go on and you basically, you know, you get the word. As you can see, I just completed the city guard. Basically, you just, you know, you just let it run for a couple of hours and it just awards you with money. Now, the game is completely free. You can get it on Steam. I will link it down in the description. I hope I can do that. I really hope I can do that and nobody's going to be shouting at me. But anyways, basically, the game is just... It's like a comic book slash... RPG game because you can play online in arena, which I'm gonna show you guys later on. But this is basically the city guard. This is like Earning money in a single player kind of thing. So basically as you can see city guard regular city guard duties are both uh, Demanding and honorable of course you will get paid for such hard work as you can see Just sleep it off man. The guy is completely passed out. We all know he wasn't watching at all So let me just show you basically the rundown so as you can see the tavern tavern is basically like where you get all the quests most of the times is this table right there at the middle so basically you know you click on a guy you know like this guy he looks like a really sad just really down to earth looking farmer okay let's see uh can you help me oh hold on let me first guy show you my oh damn i earned something what did i earn Medal of Labor, uh, current grade one, uh, two working hours. Oh, in this case, five hours. Oh, I'm a hard working citizen. Medal of the Merchant. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right, I'm running. So, as you can see, you know, we're just starting off. We're just starting off. See, still level one. But my name, it's the Felitus Trumpus. <laughs> I was trying to figure out the most stupidest name and it just it just came into my mind I don't know where it came from this is you create your own guy basically you know you, you know you can change his hair you know eyes everything it's a super geeky comic book kind of thing one thing I would say I will have to add my own music to the video because basically the game doesn't have any music so I think if anyone who make this game is watching you know you, you guys should really think about it or can I do it? Do you guys have? They don't have a thingy. Too bad. It could use music. It could, it could use like some kind of, you know, adventure music. But this is basically your guy. You can add, you know, you can add strength, you know, dexterity, intelligence, constitution, luck, you know, for 25 silver. And basically, you know, you got your money up here. You also get these mushrooms, which I think is like, you know, like a... Like an online currency that you you know you always get you know you know for fighting arena buying like you know special weapons special armor, but let's keep it going. So we were in a tavern. Now this is the arena. Obviously you know you can fight other people online. You know as you can see I got three opponents against me. I can that I can basically fight. You know as I can see this guy has a lot of dexterity, not too much strength. He has a lot of luck. So, you know, for the amount of health, I think, you know, he's, uh, he's like, basi he's basically what I am. He's a rogue, I think. Yeah, rogue is what I am. I think so. Am I a rogue? No, I'm a warrior. Yeah, I'm a warrior, but he's a rogue. So basically that means he's like a, he's like an archer, you know, he, you know, he uses a long range weapons. These two guys are same like me. As you can see, this guy is by far, I think, the most up ahead because just, you know, he's level 2. This guy is a level 2 as well, but he's, you know, he's really focusing on in the intelligence. I think the intelligence increases, let me tell you right now, 
The intelligence is the main attitude of mages. It helps to defend yourself against mages. Okay, so basically, you know, against mages. We get that. Now, let's keep going. City guard, we've been there, you know, sleep it off, whatever. Weapon shop. Now, you can obviously, you know, you can buy shot, you know, you can buy armor, weapons. I have a basic old club. Now, I can sell it, get something else, but the guy doesn't have any weapons, any other weapons. So, I'm gonna have to wait. I could buy a belt because I just got some more money. Old belt, old belt. This one has more armor, so I'm gonna buy this one. As you can see, you know, you just click it, drag it, you know, and you, you know, you will basically, you know, increase in, uh, you know, the armor, the things that you get. Well, let's give. If I would be mage, I would, you know, I would come here. Obviously, you, you know, you can buy like a, you know, rings, you know. Look not of the, you know, we weakling, you know, increases the strength, you know, helix ring of flagging, constitution plus two, you know, and just, you know, it's, it's just a game, you know, that you can enjoy and just, you know, you know, keep playing, you know, you know, you know, maybe do the city guard, earn some money, you know, just let it run in the background. I think you can also, you know, just turn it off, you know, so you could put, let me click on a city guard, you know, you could put all the way to the maximum, you know, 10 hours, just, you know, click it off, you know, let it run. And then you know then come back you know you got five gold you know and just keep doing that so basically it's a lot of time you know to sort of you know earn a lot of money and buy a lot of good things so i think that's sort of good but now here is the stables and i love the stables because they just they're just so fun i mean the guy look at his jesus smile look at the smile so, so you know you can basically you know you can buy uh i think yeah tiger you know you know just Two of the most simplest animals, you know, you can buy a cow and a horse. But this is the animal I want. It's the griffin dragon. And I want it, but the price is 25 mushrooms. And the mushrooms are super expensive. I mean, super expensive. As you can see by the price tag, that they are not, you know, that they, they did not waste that time on putting a <laughs> low budget price. But I mean, you get a lot of them, you know, from it. But, you know, let's just keep going. Obviously, you know, you got a character, you know, you can get you know, male, you know, you can have friends, as you can see, you can have a lot of people, you know, in your guild, because you can obviously create a guild, it costs 10 gold, but, you know, once you create a guild, I think, you know, a lot of things get a lot more easier, let me just show you what I mean by that, Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame basically is, you know, your rank, so as you can see, Felitos Trompus, 288,000 from England, as you can see, I'm not in a guild. I have 10 honor. And as you can see now, by what you can see right now, level 2, level 2, you know, level 1. This game has been off for only a couple of days. So if you want to get the game now and just, you know, really boost up to ranks, you know, stop playing now. You know, go get the game. It's for free. Zero graphics required. You know, I'm, you know, I'm just running it normal. So it's, you know, but it's a lot of fun. So go and try it out, obviously, if you want. Now, this is something else I want, I kind of wait to do. It's the dungeons. Basically, the, you know, you, you will, you can go through dungeons and, you know, fight these big boss, you know, battles and just, you know, earn. As a, This is all I read because I haven't got to this part yet. You can basically earn super awesome duper just weapons, armor and things that you you could use so obviously you know when i will get to this you know i will show you guys you know about the dungeons and you know how you do it but let me show you the fortress this is my fortress it's nothing on it but you know as you can see i can buy a lot of things now like fortress it costs 100 gold so you can see you can earn a lot of gold in here well, as you can see you know you have to be level 25 and uh, basically, this is all yours. You know, you build your own fortress on here. You know, so you can you, know, you can have the fort you know you have a fortress here, buildings, buildings, buildings. So you can do a lot. You know, I'm just starting out, so I'm gonna go to the tavern. We're gonna pick up a quest from this guy. Can you help me? I have a lot of problems right now. I hope you can help me. If not, I'll be in deep, deep trouble. <laughs> Mate, you I you came to the right boy right now. Okay, so we got three quests we can choose from, you know, we got a patch today, patch day, welcome, welcome, I have a great quest, uh, 
that is waiting just for you. Somebody must look for new eye patches. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that sounds easy. Uh, I can't find my old ones, and patch day is coming soon. Oh, they have something called patch day. That's awesome. Go to the stumble steepy. <laughs> Got a minimum of eleven there, and come back to me. Does this make sense to you? It makes sense to me. It will only take 15 seconds, it will gain me 134 experience and 35 silver. So we're gonna do this, let me just check this other one, beta key required. Oh, okay, if you have nothing better to do, listen to this, I really need a beta key, bad. Click Trus Tusk Mount, oh, sorry, I'm reading stupid thing, climb Tusk Mountain, there will you will meet an old monk who will not be helpful in any way. <laughs> that's a difference. Normally it's a monk that's really grateful to help me. And don't you dare you go using the key for yourself. <laughs> if you do it, do it with style. <laughs> okay. As you can see it will you know it will give us more experience but it will give us less money. And then we have fluffy ears and a knife. That doesn't sound right. Hey you goofball, do you need a job? The Blackwater Swamp wants a popular spa. Hmm, sounds good. It's now tor tormented by a dangerous beast. The target is a killer rabbit. <laughs> May I ask you kindly to ensure that no more harm will be done? Do you think you can handle this? <laughs> it's a rabbit for crying out. I think we're gonna go for this one because it will give us the most amount of experience and that's what we want right now. Because I need experience to basically get to level 2 and show you and I want to know what's be a young level 2 because I haven't got to level 2 I just literally started this game really liked it created this new guy and just showing you the new guys now so let's do this let's accept the quest wait for 15 seconds it's a super quick quick thing I know that you can go to a weapon shop during your travel so you know you can buy something if it gets down that you you know your shield will, shield will broke Oh, here we go. Horror of the night. Come on. Oh, that guy got nothing on us. Oh, that was good. As you can see, we can save the fight. This bloody creature is knocked out, and the audience is truly impressed by your heroic deed. Woohoo. Even, even if it is only a routine for you. Yes, it is. We, okay, so we got the progress. We got 180 experience gain, 10 honor 1, and loot 25. Of course, honor, horror of the night, level 1. Alright, 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 let's get Okay. Very nice. Okay, so now we can go to character level 2. Current upgrade. Okay. So, I think. Oh, yeah. Uh, Writer's necklace of. Of the weakling strength to so we got something cool all right hell yeah all right so we can go to the tavern again obviously you know we can uh, get another quest from this guy who looks just really weird but I want to try this guy welcome you seem to be smart want to play a little game of look our skill T okay Okay, so I think we can play a game. Gambling for peanuts. You won't win your match this way. I don't know what the game is anyway. I like how it says Happy Easter, right? Come on, guys. Happy Easter. I'm, so, I'm sorry, I forgot to say that. Happy Easter, guys. Happy Easter. Have an awesome Easter. I hope you're enjoying it. Okay, uh, you know what? Let's just start off. You know, gambling is not about, you know, Placing all your things at once, you know, it's about strategy. So let's start off with 16 silver and see what this place your bed is. Uh, okay, okay, middle, okay. What? How the hell do I supposed to guess that? Oh, Bala, what a pity. I don't know, we want to go again. I'm gonna go again. I wanna this guy's really okay. Place your bed. Okay, here we go. Okay, it's in the middle. On the side. I don't know. Ha! 
How the hell do you supposed to guess that? That's stupid. Oh, I'm not playing. <laughs> I hate when I lose. Right now, hold on. Wait. Okay, yeah, bartender. Happy Easter. Yeah, obviously, you know, if you guys like. Basically, first for adventure is basically what allows you to basically go on adventures. And if you run out of this, you have to come to this guy, you know, have a drink, and it will refill it up for you. So basically, you have to be drunk to try to quest, which I think is the most honorable way to do it. But we lost a lot of money on a stupid game that obviously cannot be won. And I want to buy something better. So we can buy this shield, but I don't think so there's any increase in it. So let's... Let's leave that and let's fight in arena because I want to try fight arena for you guys before I finish this video off. See if we can win an actual battle. Now we have three opponents we can choose from guys. And we have to be really careful because the person that we go against, we have to be sure that we can win against him. So I, should, I say we go against the, this guy because not only, not only he's a level one, he really focuses on his dexterity now that might be good for you know obviously being fast and doing a lot of attacks but because we have strength 23 we're gonna deal a lot of damage from just one swing and uh, plus you know we have some uh, you know luck and constitution and intelligence so I'm, I'm saying you know let's fight this guy enter let's do this let's give the fight we won! Yeah! 40, 43. Oh my god! <laughs> Yo, we just gained 43,500 rank gained. Wow, we jumped. We jumped a lot. <laughs> Valiant GR. It was an awesome to fight you, friend. Oh boy, we just stepped at the rank. Look at this guy. This guy's level 6 already. <laughs> How is he looking? How the hell is he looking? He has both eye patches. That's stupid. <laughs> but uh, hey, let, hold on. Let me go to the character. Yeah. Medal, Medal of the Gladiator. Yeah, f win one fight. Okay, uh, Medal of Heroism. Yeah, we have to go and do thingy. Uh, we have to... Dungeons. We have to do a dungeon. You don't have access to this place yet. I'm, I want to do a dungeon, but I don't know how you actually get to these dungeons. Welcome, my name is Shakes. You look like you need some hints. I know everything. Floating Crystal City Guard. As you can see, the City Guard is really on that watch. Floating Crystals. What does that do? What did that do? I don't know what it did. No, we don't want to go. Let's go to the tavern. And I think there's nothing else I can try. I mean, we could go and do another sort of quest before I finish this video off because I'm already looking out how long I've been doing this video. I've been really for, but this game is just so much fun. I'm having a lot of fun. I don't know if you guys, you know, like this sort of game. It's obviously, you know, it's a big range of, you know, games I can cover and I want to cover them all. Especially on like my channel. I just don't really have any preferences. You know if I feel like I'm gonna be doing this game I'm gonna be doing this game if I feel like I'm gonna be playing something else be playing something else Let's do one last quest because I'm gonna be playing this game anyway after I finish with this video So it doesn't matter really, but I want to do one last a mysterious crystal. I have a little goal You have a little time. I'm looking for a mysterious crystal go to the Stromble Steepy. I have a hidden I have hidden it there somewhere, but I'm not giving, I'm not going to tell you where, okay, just w don't look into the crystal or, or strange things may happen, don't forget, bad news is never rewarded, wow, okay, wow, now, now these quests have really, oh, hold on, this quest is only 18 seconds, so we could pretty much do it. Oh, how sweet. Okay, do you have the time for a great quest? The sunburned desert has a new unwelcome resident. It's a pink killer rabbit. Oh my god, what's with this rabbit? Why is everybody so afraid of a freaking rabbit? It's a rabbit. Good cry now. It's a rabbit. Rabbits are cute. They're not deadly, they're cute. Go there and slay the beast. <laughs> I like it. Are you gonna do it for me? Yes, sir, I will. And we can. What is this? 
Echo Necklace of, of the Voiceless. Oh, awesome. Okay, let's accept this quest. <laughs> Brings <laughs> I love the artwork. I honestly go, this is like the artwork I really enjoy. It's you know super colorful, you know, it's super enjoyable. You can look at it, you can play the game, you can you know enjoy it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Ba -da -ba -da. Oh. Killer <laughs> Oh one. Yes, we got a one mushroom plus we get an extra 266 experience. Let's go. Booyah. Hell yeah. Let's check out our character. And we could, we got two necklaces now, so we could pretty much choose which one we want. Now we got the brightest necklace of the weak link, which gives us two more strength, putting us up to 24 strength, or we can put on the ego necklace of the voiceless. That sounds good. Which will increase our lock, and the lock, basically what it does, it increases your chance of critical hits in a fight. And I think, just because we have already so much strength and we will take this off and we will pull this one on and now we have 17 look which is more than average of just you know getting that right amount of precision hits in but anyways guys this has been the shakes and fidget i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have don't click subscribe don't click like normally i would say you know click like subscribe but no just if you have enjoyed this video i'll Hope you're having an awesome day. Enjoy Easter. You know, you know, go s spend it, watch movies, do whatever. But yeah, just hope you enjoyed. If you really like this game, the link will be in the description. Have an awesome day. I'm signing out.